try to be. Okay. So we want to find the average slope between t equals 100 and t equals 110 point. What do we mean by the t equals 110 point? Well, that means t is 110 on this graph. Well, that means you're going to plug 110 in for t and get your y coordinate. Then you're going to have the coordinates of your point, right? Then, so you're paying attention, we should be doing that. Uh, then you, you can't help it. You plug in 100 and you get another point, and then you calculate the slope, not using a formula, because a formula isn't understanding, okay? You use rise divided by run. You figure out the rise, you figure out the run, you figure out the slope. That's the same as doing y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1, but think rise over run instead of a formula.